Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cynthia. Today I am here to film a plan with me beginning Monday, January 7th and ending Sunday, January 13th, 2019. I am planning in a 2019 hourly neutral Erin Condren Life Planner with a rose gold coil. And if you've been watching my channel, you know that this year I am trying to use up stickers and plan without using kits. So I have enough Erin Condren sticker sheets for the entire year. I think I've got that worked out. I have many, many, many hundreds of stickers in my leftover sticker binder. I have a Chrissy Ann Designs celebrations binder, and I have Simply Gilded Washi that I'm planning to pull into my spreads, including this week, to try to really make more responsible use of the stickers that I have and kind of have been hoarding. So uh, this week, the sticker sheet that I have chosen is this winter llama pattern. And I don't fully understand the llama thing, you guys, I'm going to admit. But what I love about this is this sort of Fair Isle sweater pattern that's in the background with the snowflakes. And the llamas, you know, they're cute, fine, whatever. Um, to mark my work time, I have this Simply Gilded Washi, which let me try to get that to zoom is a really, really pretty gray, and the pattern matches exactly with this pattern in the boxes here. So I'm gonna use that to mark my work times. I'm gonna use this to sort of provide the decoration. My leftover sticker binder is right here. I'm gonna use this dark teal color, which matches pretty well for a to-do, so let me pull that out. Set that on the tripod. I do have a dinner's header that matches that right here. Most of these are a little Miss Papery. Uh, as you guys can see, there's a lot of them. I'm not 100% sure, however, so I'm not going to uh, worry about it too much, but just FYI. And then for my whoops, boxes, I have these really pretty gray. These are a little Miss Papery. I don't have a weekly box that matches. I'm really kind of short on weekly boxes, as you can see. I'm just going to use two weeklies and turn the bottom one in, or sorry, two checklists and turn the bottom into a weekly. And then I have a three heart for my midweek, Ooh, which means I need to grab a today also. So let's just jump back here. Yeah, and I have a today in that same color. Most of my Little Miss Papery leftovers come from kits that I've purchased in the last couple of years. Uh, I, I couldn't tell you the names of them anymore most of the time. A few are little mystery boxes that I have used, but what I discovered is that I've been a mis little mystery box subscriber, or I was a little mystery box subscriber for over a year and just hoarded. Now what I did not do is choose glitter headers because I'm a dope. So let me really quickly just rifle through and find something that will work. Okay, I think I'm going to use, these are the Ombre Glitter Headers from Sticker Sis. And I'm thinking I kind of want to use this one because it has like a tealy green with a blue going into a gray. So I don't use these all that often and that is because the finish on them is glossy and I am not a big glossy sticker fan, but I will make exceptions occasionally. So let us begin. Now the washi strips here are uh, really thick. So in this case, if you were to put them at the top, they're gonna cover like two and a half hours. So I think my plan uh, probably most of the time is going to be to put them in at the bottom. And that is because they line up quite nicely. And if I'm going to do something in the evening, I can certainly put a sticker over the washi, but when school is in session, you guys, I do not go out on weeknights uh, because I have to be up too early. And I don't mind this covering over. It covers from about 7 p.m. down to the bottom if you try to line it up exactly. And I don't have to flip this upside down because I'm putting it down close to me. If I were trying to put it at the top, there'd be some planner flipping going on. Now, I'm trying to decide the last couple times, well, the last time I should say, I when I use Erin Condren sticker sheets, I tend not to use these strips. And the last time I used it to mark um, 
school. So I think I might use one to mark school. I did use the uh, little checklist things, which I rarely ever do. But um, I do want to make sure I get these there in case you're not familiar with the sheet. This is a little like a vertical box. This is like a little horizontal box. And then this is like a half box washi strip and this is a half box washi strip. And then there are flags, which the flag color goes well enough. Last week I didn't cover the flags either and I used green. So you could use these. I'm pretty sure uh, that the size is... Oh, that's a lie. Never mind. You cannot use these to cover the flags. <laughs> so if you were trying to do that, don't. Yeah, what I was thinking about doing is maybe putting the strips like across the top to add a little another pop of color up there. Uh, but I do put down gym stickers up there anyway, so maybe not. Maybe let's go uh, right to the sidebar, which involves me flipping the planner, which I can still do because it's early in the year and it is not too bulked up. Then we'll zoom you in. And I do not yet have my Keep Calm stickers that I've made. So I'm gonna go ahead and use some old ones that I've had in my stash for quite some time. These are from the Rabbit Tribe. And I've been making my own of these, but haven't done it yet, it's on the list for today. Uh, so we're gonna just grab a Keep Calm at semester break. And that doesn't match perfectly with what's going on here, but it doesn't have to. Oops, that's right. I need to align from the top because that J in January sticks down a little bit. So if you start at the bottom, you will cover over it. Okay, welcome back and sorry for the delay. What you missed was me putting down some glitter headers that were not the right size and realizing uh, that they were just not gonna work. So what I'm gonna use instead are these leftover Little Miss Papery Filthy Animal Glitter Headers. I'm gonna use this tealy dark green color because it's gonna pick up the teal in the kit. And the, uh, the little Keep Calm box is not sized correctly for an Erin Condren, I think they're meant it as a quote box. So I do have to kind of center this a little bit. My habit tracker is a leftover little Miss Papery and kind of a bluish color because I don't have anything gray. All right, we're gonna go ahead and do another glitter header. Just because I... like these. Her new glitter is uh, finer and it's very pretty. So I've got my to-do list, which yeah, this looks really good together. Yeah, I will say planning this way does take a little more time and, and sort of effort planning for the planning, but I think after I've used up a bunch of stuff, I will feel a whole lot better about my uh, planning purchases. And maybe next year I'll do something else. I also still have, sorry about that you guys, my uh, memory card filled up on me. I thought I had cleared it off before I began this, but apparently not. So where we were, I'm not sure when it stopped, I'll be able to figure that out when I go to edit, was I had just finished the sidebar with Little Miss Papery stickers. It did overlay a little bit here at the bottom, but that's okay. And then I want to go ahead and, whoops, I guess I can just leave it here. I want to go ahead and put in my work time with uh, Simply Gilded Washi. And again, this is that gray color with the really pretty Fair Isle uh, snowflake pattern. And I have been putting this on the right side of the day uh, and that works really well because then I can still see the times when I have to schedule myself for meetings. And because I am doing administrative, oh, it's almost like a purpley gray, it's really pretty. 
Uh, because my role this semester is administrative rather than classroom instruction, oh, that's so pretty. Um, my sticker's lifting a little bit. Uh, I need to mark my time a little bit differently. If you've watched me in the past, you know I tend to make uh, weekly class stickers, so I have like a base spread down when I begin, and that is that is not what you're seeing because uh, because it's just gonna be a different semester. Now Wednesday, I am not going in until uh, twelve thirty because I have. Uh, some home repair work being done. So I almost oops. Almost goofed that up. That's a four hour day. I guess I could just not go in that day, but I just, you know, I'm one of those employees that feels guilty if I'm not at work and I'm not sick or taking personal time. And in that case, I'm taking just half a personal day. I'll probably end up working from home for a portion of it, but Okay, and then on Friday, it is my last day of the class that I'm taking. So I do need to mark that for, I'll be it in doing the work thing from 8 to 12.30. Oh my gosh, that's so nice. And then I need to, I'm gonna use a piece of this Erin uh, Condren sticker sheet. Put that in from one to five. I'm trying to do this without taking it off the sheet, and that is already not going to work. So, so we'll just put this in one, two, five. Oops. I really like the new, uh, the darker dots in the hourly. I've been using the hourly since I joined the Erin Condren let's say family rather than cult, because it kind of feels like a cult. I'm gonna actually flip this around though, because I probably should have used the craft knife and I wanna cover over that edge. Sticker. Um, yeah, and this is the first year that the dots are a little bit darker. Additionally, uh, this is my first year in the neutral, and people told me that when I went to the neutral, I would love it and never want to go back and so far, you guys, I mean, I, the colorful is so pretty. I cannot get this in there straight. But there is something about the freedom and the muted colors in the neutral that are just making me dizzy with love for this planner. So let me zoom you back out. Whoops. Okay. So that is super duper pretty. For work stickers, I could just use like quarter boxes, but I do not have uh, a whole lot of those actually. So what I was thinking I would do, at least for a while, is um, use some of the stickers that I've made myself. And I do have options for that. Uh, I do have um, work stickers. I'm gonna see if I have five of the same color. That would be these. These are from Planning Chaco. And, ooh, you guys. Oh, there's only four. Bugger. But you know what? These five are close enough. I'm gonna go ahead and use these. I'm gonna put this one down here because then it won't be as noticeable that it's different. And I'm gonna put it, even though I'm not going to work till 12.30, I'm gonna put it in at 12 because I just like the way it looks better when it's in the box there. So we'll just put these puppies down.
oh my gosh, those so, are so cute. So I will need to make like another sheet of these, it looks like, so that when I have, because I've not worked a five-day work week in almost 20 years, you guys. My teaching schedule has always been a, a Monday through Thursday. But I really like these, and uh, I think maybe I'll just make a second sheet of them. Since I'm going to have to figure out how to mark work for, you know, another like 18 weeks. That's how long this administrative post is going to last. So that is super cute. Okay, I need to get something to mark school for that class that I'm taking. And I think... Yeah, I do have, I have this quarter box from Little Miss Papery. It actually matches this over here. So I think I want to use that just to kind of pull in. Move it a little over to the right and put some kind of icon over here. I do have this cute little uh, book icon from Little Miss Papery. I'm just going to go ahead and put that right there and voila! Now that makes me super happy. Okay, now you guys, there is this really, now this is really cute. This is Chrissy and Designs. These are her kind of wacky holidays. This is part of the 2017-18 Celebrations Binder. Uh, and January 8th is Bubble Bath Day. Which, am I going to take a bubble bath on January 8th? Probably not. But why not put it in here, right? Because it's cute. And yeah, hooray. Okay, I feel like this is sticking up, but it really isn't. It just, it's the way the stickers are that it, it looks like it's sticking up a little bit, but it's not. Okay, and then I need to mark my gym time, my gym workouts. And my plan right now, you guys, is to use my Little Miss Papery workout stickers until such time as I run out of them. And then I'll figure out something else. But I think I've got enough that I can make it through this semester with these. Yeah, I do. Hopefully the colors will work out. Um, and I'm kind of drawn to this teal color. Okay, and there are five of them. which is awesome. Okay, so those, I am going to turn the planner upside down. Sorry for the spinning. Those I will, I do first thing in the morning. So I'm going to go ahead and just put those in here. And my gym is actually at at school at work so since I don't start work till 8 I get to work between 6 and 6 30 and that gives me time to do the bike the rowing machine weights uh, and then some manner of I have to put this in here 
get to go to the gym before I before I get into the office there. And if something happens that I can't do this Wednesday, I'll still be doing four days a week. Um, but yeah, so I started to say I do uh, the rowing machine, then I do, or the bike, then the rowing machine, then weights. I do arms Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I do legs Tuesday, Thursday. And then I try to walk on the treadmill, um, which usually gets me about an hour and 20 minutes Uh workout. Now from using the leftover sticker book, um, it does not damage the stickers, but these old paper, Little Miss Papery uh, stickers don't, they don't re-stick really well. So especially on the right side for some reason, this one is lifting up. So I'm just using my cheap 99 cent glue stick from the grocery store. And yeah, just give me a little dab of purple glue. Sometimes it does leave a little bit of residue that you have to rub off just a little bit. So it's like eraser shaving, so it doesn't damage anything. Um, okay, so let's flip this back around. Then my, I'm gonna kind of forego the midweek checklist this week because uh, I'm gonna put it on Sunday as an end of week checklist instead. And that is because without having to prep for teaching, um, this is really my planning checklist. Uh, or this is really the where I post the things that I film, edit, and upload. So for film, edit, and upload this week, you guys, I do have a planning Chaco sticker that I made myself. That is right here. And I'm going to go ahead and plan for that to occur probably on Saturday morning, it looks like. So we won't do it super early. I tend to fart around on weekends when I'm not working. That is just a thing that happens. But now let's just run through. I've got my sticker binder here, which I've taken a lot of stuff out of it, but there's still a lot of stuff in here. Uh, now this week... I do have my cleaning ladies coming. So for a cleaning service, you know, I haven't used any of the purple yet from the uh, from the sticker sheet. Um, that's the one color I don't have a whole lot of in here. So let me just grab this cleaning service. Oh, and I also wanted to, sorry you guys, the organization schema of this uh, video is going to leave something to be desired, but... I did remember that uh, habit trackers I want to use a no spend and I do have a habit trackers tab in this sticker binder so when we flip to that uh, I could use that purple too um, I do have these are really cute Soda Pop Studios, and one has popped out here, this blue. Let's get that back in there. Okay, I do want to get a pack lunch one because I now take lunch from home five days a week. And then I think I'm going to go ahead with this purple 
for my little side of habit trackers. I think I'm going to put no spend right at the very bottom here. And then pack lunch. Um, I'll just put right alongside it. Yeah, that is adorable. Love it. For charging my devices, I do have these Little Miss Papery charge stickers. I'm gonna grab the purple, which trust me, you guys, it really is, there is purple that you're gonna see in just a minute here. So we'll just put that down there and then we'll do that also on Saturday morning. And I'm hoping that I will be able to get some Oh yeah, this is how we're going to do it. Some planner time in. Not just the film editing and uploading, but I would really like to get my dailies set up. Now I do have, like I said, I've got a contractor coming out to my house on the 9 o'clock. on Wednesday. So we're just going to put that in there. And then I had this idea. I have these skinny appointment labels. In my leftover stash, I think these are from um, I think they're from Peaceful Mind Design. So what I'm gonna do is put this little guy in here at nine. Yeah, and then put this underneath it just to kind of mark that, that chunk of time. Yeah, cool. Now you can see the purple that I've been talking about being in here, like for real. Then I have church on Saturday evening. Uh, and I think, I think maybe I'm gonna use this color here, this kind of lighter tealy color. Let's put that in. Church will be at four. And then I have plans with a friend of mine after that. So I'm going to grab this from the sheet. There's this box with like a hole in it. And just put that right there. Cool. By the way, I am filming this on Sunday, which is really late for me to film, but there you have it. I'm actually going to make myself a pot pie for dinner tonight, and that is going to feed me, I think. I'll have leftovers four days in a row, so I will not have to cook. Uh until Friday. Ooh, and I have a manicure appointment. So I'm gonna grab this last little piece of washi. My mani is at six. So. Yeah, sorry, my nails are an atrocious disaster. But what are you gonna do, guys? They have held up really well, actually, considering that I just took down all the Christmas decorations, but they don't look very nice. Uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and use this purple manicure. Now it's a lot darker than the other purple in the kit, or the on the sticker sheet, but 
These are from Mila Print Shop, by the way. And I really like them. I'm so bummed that her shop does not exist anymore, but. Uh, okay, so we do have a meeting. Oh my gosh, I have several meetings I need to, to mark down here. Okay, hold on. Okay, I think I want to try to use, since it looks like I have gone to gold foil this week, we have these Erin Condren labels. And I think I can make this work because I have a meeting. Um, well, first of all, I have a, a task that I have to complete by noon on Monday, which is to approve time cards for uh, the people that report to me in my new job, in my temporary new job. So I do have this skinny in my stash here, this skinny Little Miss Papery gold foiled sticker. The foiling on this on these stickers wasn't very good. I think she was just experimenting a little bit. But I do want to just write that down as a deadline. I plan to do it before then. But I'm very visual and it helps me to see when it has to be done. And then at 1 o'clock I have an appointment. Um, I think maybe for that one. There's already a lot of purple over here. So for that we're going to use like a teal. Just put that in from one. It could go as long as till three, but I don't think so. So I'm just gonna leave it like that. Um, okay, that's that. Then here on Thursday, we have a meeting, which is at 9.30. And again, this could go to 11 potentially, but I'm not sure. And then at one o'clock, I have another meeting. And for that one, I'm going to grab purple. Yeah, I'm kind of unprepared for how many meetings this uh, job has got so far. All right, so I'm going to make a little executive decision to swap this really quickly. I want to grab a darker purple for that meeting at one. because I iron on Monday nights. So I'm gonna put that in. When I get home from work, it'll be like 5.30-ish. Okay, so that's ironing. And then I think that's it for, I, I really like these stickers, you guys. I was uh, a little hesitant at first because I didn't realize there were the three different color metals but I love these. The only problem I have with them is there isn't any blue, but these are wonderful. So, uh, I did want to use this sticker. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this in like it's a continued decoration. If you guys see what I'm doing, this is just because it's pretty. And these are, the vertical ones are a little bit narrow for the space, but it's okay. I'm going to use this purple up top for my Sunday checklist. Okay. Okay, back to, yeah, I said there's going to be, it's going to be leftovers through, uh, I will probably stop at, at the drive-thru on Friday between 
Yeah, I think I'm going to have to. That's okay. So I do have these leftover stickers from Sweet Kawaii Design. And I'm just going to go ahead and put those in. And then I do have these cute little stickers from Soda Pop Studio. These say takeout. So I think I'm going to grab just a... Uh, I'll use a blue one because there's purple right next to it. So let's actually move manicure over to this side. Put takeout right there. So I'll just run through the drive through on my way from one to the other. I am going to grocery shop after my manicure, you guys, which might sound insane, but Friday night grocery shopping, whoops, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Um, Friday night grocery shopping, if you are not a fan of being around like a whole lot of people, is magnificent. It, uh, it actually works so well. Um, I can get in and out of there and it's really fast. I'm going to grab just, I have a, uh, like a gray appointment label. So I think, I don't remember if this, I think this might be a little mispapery. I'm going to go ahead and just put that right down here. Covering over a little bit of the llamas, but that's okay. And then I'm going to just grab a grocery shop sticker. I have these cute little icons. These are from Peaceful Mind Design. I'm going to grab a blue one. Just put it right over here and then just, yeah. For my ironing, um, I think I think I want to use a Sweet Kawaii Design. These are my favorite ironing stickers, you guys. I am absolutely obsessed with these. I'm going to grab the purple one and just put that right down here. And then I need to build my Sunday checklist, which is going to include washing the bedding. So I love this little sugar loop laundry sticker and this purple and teal one really goes well this week. So we'll just put that there for laundry. It is also a payday this week and I have Little Miss Papery payday stickers. I think I'm going to go ahead and use a teal one because I'm trying to, Ooh, actually, you know what? That's a lie. I'm going to use this darker green because it's going to pick up again that, that accent color that I've kind of worked in here. So we'll just put that baby right up there. I do have these really cute little planner stickers. And I think I'm going to grab one of the purple ones. Just for my little film edit and upload here, I'm going to turn this into a planner because it's a plan with me. Those, by the way, are from Peaceful Mind Design, the little planner sticker. My reading night is probably going to be Thursday this week. Dedicated reading time with devices switched off. And I have these cute Planorama reading flags. Um, I think I'm going to pull in some blue, maybe. Yeah, I'm going to grab this sort of aqua blue because it does pick that up nicely. I don't think it'll start right at six, but I'll just mark it. Here. My Sugar Loop reading glasses. These are so cute. I'm going to grab the purple ones. Let's put those right on there. And then I do have these adorable unplug stickers from Peaceful Mind Design that I use 
uh, in conjunction with my reading. And I'm going to grab one of the purple ones just to mark that off. By the way, if you're trying to figure out the organizational system for my stickers, they're roughly alphabetized. So like the teacups are under T, the teeth are under T, right? And then U, etc. Um, it is tea season whilst planning. So I'm going to grab one of my little mugs of tea and just put that right over here. And then my doggy's teeth. My doggies just had a teeth cleaning done, actually, and they also had uh, a cyst removed. So they, uh, they, they are hurting a little bit, um, but I can still do their teeth. And I want to, now that they're, we've kind of wiped the slate clean, um, I want to make sure I do it every, I, I do it every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. But I've only been really good about that for the last year. So, teeth are from Peaceful Mind Design. When these are done, I will probably use paw prints until those are done, so I can avoid buying stickers. Um, for garbage and recycling, I think I'm going to use my Peaceful Mind Design. So trash and recycling, these go together um, every Sunday night. And I would remember, even if I didn't put these in here, I just like the way they look. I said before, nothing makes you feel like a homeowner, like walking that garbage out to the curb. Um, in my list here, I do need to wash bedding this week, and I think for that I'm going to use this kind of aqua wash bedding sticker. Just put it right over here. Probably going to end up covering over a good portion of that. Uh, I need to scale a weigh in every Friday. So I'm going to grab just a little purple one and put that up here. Writing time is supposed to be Saturday or Sunday morning and right, I'm supposed to be doing a better job at that this year but since I haven't even got my planners organized yet guys uh, I'm kind of sucking a little bit there. However All right, optimism is a thing, and maybe this will be the week. All right, I don't really have a quarter box. I'm going to grab another one of these little skinny appointment labels. I'm pretty sure those are from Peaceful Mind Design. I'll just put that in here. So it's supposed to be first thing in the morning. Okay. And then for writing, I'm just going to grab the little... little piece of paper and a little blogger sticker. Just put those together. There we go, that's cute. Then I just need to do the last of my checklist items which involve clipping coupons. I'm going to grab the purple. These are Mila Print Shop. Actually, you know what? I'm going to put this down here because folding laundry, I'm gonna make this all kind of like a laundry scene. So we'll put that fold laundry right there. Clip coupons, unload dishwasher I do on Monday. I'm gonna grab the dark purple. Put that right here when I get home, throw some dinner together. And then I just need to water plants and I'm gonna again grab purple. These are Mila Print Shop. And then that will happen um, before I leave work on Friday. So that, I think, does it. Um, I know this is longer than you're used to from me. I will, of course, try to edit it down, but uh, I'm pleased. I think this came out really cute. I'm really liking um, planning this way. Like I said, it's just so different. But uh, let me know what you think. If you have questions or comments, please share them down below. Uh, if you're doing something different in your planner, tell me about it. I'd like to hear it. And uh, I hope you're having a wonderful week. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.